Jumping from space, often referred to as a space jump or space dive, is a daring and technically challenging endeavor that involves a person free-falling from the edge of space back to Earth. The most famous space jump to date was performed by Felix Baumgartner in 2012 as part of the Red Bull Stratus project. Here's an overview of how such a jump works. One high-altitude balloon launch. The journey begins with a high-altitude balloon ascent. A specially designed space capsule or gondola is attached to the balloon, and it carries the jumper to the desired altitude. In Felix Baumgartner's case, he ascended to an altitude of approximately 39 kilometers, 24 miles, in the stratosphere. 2. Spacesuit. The jumper wears a high-tech spacesuit, often referred to as a pressure suit or spacesuit. This suit provides life support, protection from extreme temperatures and low pressure, and a visor to protect against UV radiation. 3. Preparation and safety checks. Prior to the jump, the jumper undergoes extensive training and safety checks to ensure they are physically and mentally prepared for the experience. This includes practicing emergency procedures and familiarizing themselves with the equipment. 4. Exit from the capsule. At the designated altitude, the jumper exits the space capsule and begins their freefall. During Felix Baumgartner's jump, this occurred at approximately 39 kilometers, 24 miles, above Earth's surface. 5. Free Fall and Acceleration The jumper enters a state of free fall and accelerates rapidly due to the lack of atmospheric resistance in the near vacuum of the stratosphere. During this phase, they can reach supersonic speeds. 6. Controlled Descent The jumper uses their body position and a small drogue parachute to control their descent and maintain stability. This is crucial to prevent dangerous spins or uncontrollable movements. 7. Main Parachute Deployment At a predetermined altitude, the jumper deploys their main parachute. This parachute is designed to slow down the descent and provide a controlled landing. 8. Landing The jumper lands safely on Earth, typically at a designated recovery area where a support team is waiting to assist. Felix Baumgartner's historic space jump in 2012 set multiple records, including the highest jump from the stratosphere and the first person to break the sound barrier in freefall without the aid of a vehicle. The jump also provided valuable data for scientific research related to high altitude and supersonic freefall. Space jumps are extreme and require meticulous planning, safety measures, and specialized equipment. They provide unique insights into the challenges of human survival and performance in the extreme conditions of the upper atmosphere and near space.